Good morning guys and <clears throat> happy Sunday. Uh, back to a messy kitchen. Cups and plates from last night. Come on, see. Uh, yeah, late start for today. It's like 11 o'clock. Um, John and I, it was gone one before we went to bed last night. So we're not normally late people. Like I'm normally awake quite early because you know come midnight i'm faster fast asleep but last night we were up well past one so yeah um dressed i've done a little bit of editing john's just got in the shower uh i'm gonna do a quick tidy up but today is gonna be a lazy one because we're both i don't know if you can hear it in my voice but we're both feeling a bit germy um so i've got the, all the windows open to let some fresh air in and i'm gonna do a bit of a quick clean and then <coughs> coffee will most definitely be record recorded required <laughs> oh my poof has gone too poofy as well Ugh. <sighs> happy sunday guys <laughs> making ordinary coffee. Well I am, it's normal coffee but it's percolated coffee, filter coffee, whatever you want to call it. Cafeter, cafeter that's it. Cafeter coffee and it's premium blend fur trade from Sainsbury's because Katie fancied it yesterday when we went to Sainsbury's so we've dug out the cafeter, it's been a long time and uh, let's have some real coffee for a change. And it's breakfast time and we've got French pressed coffee and we've got raisin and cinnamon bread with crunchy organic peanut butter. I have banana on mine and John has um, sliced apple on his. So yeah, a bit different but something what we fancied. Hey guys, so we've just watched, well we watched Last Leg and then we did about half hour, 45 minutes work in the garden. Um, we don't have plants in our garden because it's the wrong time of year um, and everything we try to plant ends up with dog wee on it so it doesn't live very long um, so it's more of a tidy up um, you know we've got patios and, and gravel and this kind of weather you get that green on it so did some of that and yeah now it's time for lunch John's done another uh, French press thingy um, so I'm feeling a bit buzzy yeah, have some lunch and a coffee. And we're having a bit of a late lunch. So we've got some mini flatbreads, ham, um, silver skin pickles, pate, Pringles, cheese, um, hummus, carrot sticks. And then John has got, no, that's cucumber. John has got carrot sticks. Um, and instead of, I've got the same, but apart from I don't have carrot sticks, I've got red pepper. And John isn't the biggest fan of red raw peppers, so that's what we're having. And it's tea time and I've got considerably more gravy than John. Um, we've got lamb shanks with mint gravy, um, carrot and swede mash and then peas, carrots, broccoli and sweet corn. So lots of veggies and lots of meat. So yeah, that one's mine, and that one's John's. What are you doing, Beach? Baking ice cream with my new forefront. <laughs> with your... Well, you're not using it, are you? John bought me this for Christmas. What does it do? It makes ice cream, that's frozen fruit. 
Oh, ice cream like stuff. That one you're going to want to move, mate, because it's been so lively. That one's very interested. You ready? And it's dessert time and we've got dairy-free ice cream made with our fro fru that John got me for Christmas. Just used it for the first time. Banana, strawberries and blueberries. And it looks like ice cream, kind of. Kind of excited to try it though. 